Four new members as well as a new canine joined the Corning Police Department and Fire Department earlier this morning. And our very own Lindsay Madison spoke with the city's newest members and why they say they decided to serve the community. Lindsay. Nick and Renata, two members were sworn into the Corning Police Department and two members were sworn into the Fire Department. Each person, whether they were joining law enforcement or becoming an official member of the Fire Department, say it's like a dream come true. I, Justin Gross, I, Justin Gross. do solemnly swear that I will support the Constitution of the United States. Justin Gross and Connor LeBaron were sworn into the Fire Department. Gross says becoming a firefighter is following in his family's footsteps. It's been a lifelong dream of mine to become a fireman. I watched my dad do it. Um, he was a chief for a volunteer department back where we live. I watched him for many years and just uh, fell in love with it. So that's what I always wanted to do. LeBaron says he grew up in Corning and always wanted to be a firefighter. He's been a firefighter for the last six years and is excited to now be a full-time member. I'm looking forward to serving the community that I grew up in, um, being around family and friends and being able to help the community as much as I can with my job, um, and it's something I'm looking forward to. David Du Bois and Brennan Hardy were sworn into the police department. Du Bois says law enforcement runs in the family, but at first, it wasn't something he wanted to do. Du Bois was an MP in the Army and then became a police officer, which he says was helpful transitioning from the military back to civilian life. The city of Corning is, the structure is very similar to the military and how it was. Um, so it's nice having that same structure with the command staff and the leadership makes it a very easy transition. Hardy says he always wanted to be a police officer and help people when they need it. The city of Corning has a lot of opportunities as far as professional uh, career growth. Um, there's also never-ending opportunity to be able to help the community and be able to reach out something new every day. Congratulations. As for the canine, his name is Mikey, and he's a German Shepherd who came from Arkansas. Mikey is being trained and handled by Officer Christopher Clare. Mikey is named after the former police lieutenant Michael Schwartz, who died several years ago. Lieutenant Schwartz joined the Corning Police Department in 1989 and retired in 2008 after 24 years of service. Nick.